Teresa from Depth Samurai and today I'm going to introduce you to Teamboard Time Planner, your solution for efficient time management and team collaboration. Let's get started. Click on the app and choose Teamboard Time Planner to accept it. Click on the dashboard tab. User can change the time range. If you prefer to see the data tab inside your team, you can choose the All Team Members option or select specific team members whose data they would like to view. Additionally, you can easily expand or export the data to image format. The dashboard provides each side of the overview compared to the previous month schedules and the report in the members tab my profile and dashboard you will find the overview of your information yeah similar to the main dashboard switch to profile tab to view the detailed information about yourself, you can export your profile and also you can edit your profile information, include the job title, department, introduction, technical skill, yeah, and uh, experience. In the time sheet tab, you can access to the time sheets and view their status. In the leave tab, user can see the details about their leave status, and uh, user can also request the leave. The report tab allows you to view any reports associated with your profile. Finally, you can access to the setting tab to customize various of Teamboard Time Planner to suit your reference. Here you can choose the capacity. And also choose the holiday calendar. The all resource provides a detailed view of all available resources. If you are an admin, you can rate the resource. Click rate add new button. View rate and click add. To adjust the resource capacity by the capacity section. Here you can input the resource capacity to take the task or project. In the team tab, you have ability to manage teams. Click on the create new team, enter the team name, and add the members to the team. And to review and plan for the team, you can navigate to the team schedule. Yeah. Additionally, you have an option to set as team leader for multiple users. You also see at least view team. Edit the team name, remove or add members to existing team. You can create a new client in the client tab. 
disable our query thing client B for two project development and project mobile users who are client admins have ability to manage the client's list and schedule tasks for clients you can easily schedule tasks for specific client by selecting the client when creating or assigning tasks schedule tab choosing the team or the member you want to schedule and choosing between the team view or individual view you can easily navigate the calendar by scrolling to the today and selecting the time range by clicking on the sold work clock, you can view the detailed work clock information. You can see detail in it. And to plan the task, uh, find the issue in the issue parts and drag it onto the members calendar. Or you can click on the calendar to open the plan issue dialog. Choose the client issues and add viewable if needed. You can assign multiple team members to the task. Then click the plan button. Oh, that says you also can reside the cards. I reside the white and the hate. Change the status and customize the task color. In the time lock tab, user can lock their time for scheduled tasks. Click on the white space and start locking working time for task or event. Choosing the task you want to lock the time. And then click lock time button. This is what I just created. Start track the time span for each specific task with the timer. Click start timer and selecting the issue. Or you can click on the play button on the issues timer will start to track. And if you want to stop, you can lock this time. You can lock this time or cancel it. If you change your mind, you can keep it. Example, I will lock this time. It will appear on the chair light and is this today? You can also work with time block on the issue detail panel. To see the timber time planner to enable the panel, you can see add time block and start timer button. And after complete your work, you will need to submit your time sheet. Choosing 
the approval and click submit or if you change your mind you can click record The approver will receive your submitted timesheet in the timesheet approval tab. They can approve or reject it, as well as add any necessary notes. And in the My Time Sheet tab, you can view reports of your time sheet. Similarly, you can access time sheet reports of all members of your team if you are a team leader. To see the team and to see the member, you want to see the reports. Users can see details about their leave status, leave allocation, remain leave days, taken days. Users also make a leave request, choose the range of times, leave time and approval as well. Choose another day because uh, I can request today. Okay. Leave requests which were sent to the user to approve are listed in leave approval. Approver can accept or reject the leave. Yeah, you can see uh, the information in the panel. Users who are building admins have ability to add cost for each task during the scheduling process. When scheduling, you can choose the right type that has been set in the settings. Or you can customize it according to your specific needs. Once you have set the cost for tax, uh, you can navigate to the cost tab to view the response for individual resources, teams, projects, and clients. Go to the report tab to view detailed status report for member, task, and group. You can switch between uh, this tab and see all about the report. In the setting, you can uh, setting uh, a lot of things. Example, allow the user change <coughs> the approval, the default approval, or everything with easy. About the permissions, add the user with specific permissions. However, please note that you cannot delete yourself from the systems. Working capacity, the maximum amount of work that can be performed by a member. You can create a new capacity screen, set it default, edit, 
delete capacity is three or assign working capacity stream to the resource. Admin can update the holiday calendar. Other members can only view the holiday calendar. You can edit import the country holidays or create the new holiday calendar. Enable the leave approval flow workflow allows all leave requests go to through an approval process. Allocation days, number of the days allocated per year, leave ties, manage and create a leave tie. The rate and cost set in future allows you to configure the rate type for easier scheduling and cost calculations. Few data, few data, the data to add on your profile information. Data field mapping the start day and end day to zero fields. Choosing the project you want to map then start to mapping. Just click it to start mapping. My settings allows you to personalize your settings and preference similar to my setting option in the dashboard. If you have any further questions, feel free to reach out to our support team for assistance. Thank you for watching.